let's look at some of the properties which are satisfied by all the binary trees. So the first property is that maximum number of nodes at level L of a binary tree is 2 raised to the power L minus 1. So we are required to find the maximum number of nodes, not minimum. So maximum number of nodes at a level will be uh, there when uh, the, that level is completely filled. So when a binary tree is completely filled, then we fill all the possible positions. So here level starts from number 1. So root is at level 1 and it has one node. So 2 raised to the power 0, that is 1 minus 1. In the next, uh, the maximum number of nodes will be double of previous level. Because if, suppose at some level we have 4 nodes, this is not, this is some level, then maximum number of nodes in the next level will be when each node has 2 children. So binary tree can have 0, 1 or 2 children. So maximum will be when each node has two children. So each node has two children. So if we have four nodes at some level L, then at the next level maximum we can have two times four, that is eight nodes, because each node has two children. So here we will use this property. So first level has one node, Second level will have two times previous, that is one, that is two nodes. Next, again double that, so four. Next, eight, so this is two raised to the power one, this is two raised to the power two, this is two raised to the power three. Every time we multiply by two, so the power of two increases by one. And at level one, it's zero, at level two, it's one level 2, level 3, it's 2, so 1 less than level number. So that's why 2 raised to the power L minus 1. Now next property is that maximum number of nodes in a binary tree of height h is 2 raised to the power h minus 1. So again maximum number of nodes. What is the maximum number of nodes in a binary tree? When every level is completely filled. So here if we have a tree like this. So this also has height of 3, 1, 2 and 3. But we can add more number of nodes without increasing the height. That is this and this. So maximum number of nodes occurs when every node has two children. Now if we increase the any node, then the height of tree will increase. Now it is given that uh, the height of tree is h. That is all the h levels are completely filled. So if height is 1, we have 1 node. If height is 2, we have 1 plus 2 node. If height is 3, we have 1 plus 2 plus 4 nodes. If we have 4 height, then we have 1 plus 2 plus 2 square plus 2 cube nodes. Similarly, 2 raised to the power h minus 1. So this is a simple geometric progression with h values and uh, the ratio is 2 here. So 2 raised to the power h minus 1 divided by ratio minus 1 that is 2 minus 1 equal to 2 raised to the power h minus 1 divided by 2 minus 1 is 1. So anything divided by 1 is the numerator itself. Now let's look at third property which is in a binary tree with n nodes minimum possible height or minimum number of levels both are same thing is log base 2 n plus 1. Now how we will get this? We had seen in property 2 that n max, where n max denote maximum number of nodes with height h is 2 h minus 1. So here n max which is n is equal to 2 h minus 1. So this is from 
property 2 that we saw just now. Now uh, move 1 to this side. So we get n plus 1 equal to 2 raised to the power h. Now take the logarithm of base 2 on both sides. So this anything in ex exponent or power comes here. So it becomes h times log 2 2. So this log 2 2 is 1. So this uh, h becomes log 2 n plus 1 and hence the proof minimum possible height is log 2 n plus 1. Now the last property for this video a binary tree with l leaves has at least log 2 l plus 1 levels. Now uh, maximum number of leaves or minimum number of levels occurs when all levels are completely filled. So at least this much levels that is minimum number of levels for a given number of leaves will be when all levels are completely filled that is all leaves lie at a same level. All leaves are at level L. So this is possible when all leaves are at the same level because if we have leaves at different level so here these two are leaves and this one is leaves. So here maximum height is 3 but number of leaves is 3. But if we add more leaves we get 4 leaves with the same height, same number of levels. Maximum number of leaves and minimum number of levels will be when all the leaves are at same level. So let all the leaves are at level L. Then from property 1 we know that maximum number of nodes at level L is 2 raised to the power L minus 1. So maximum number of leaves will be 2 raised to the power L minus 1. Or so if L denotes maximum number of leaves then this will be equal to 2 raised to the power L minus 1. Now let's take the log on both sides. Now move 1 to this side, so L becomes 1 plus log 2 L, hence the proof. So I hope uh, you understood all of these proofs, if not then try watching the video again.